What's going on guys? In today's video, I want to give you an update on my first deposit into my Roth IRA account. And if you don't know what a Roth IRA account is, it's just an investment account that allows you to kind of grow your money tax deferred. You pay your tax upfront, and then the idea is at an older stage in your life, you make more money, so you should be taxed more, but because you pay the tax upfront now, you kind of save money on that tax. <laughs> that's a lot of tax stuff, which I'm not an expert in, but that's pretty much my understanding of it. So yeah, it's also because it, it's another, it's a main milestone on my journey to financial freedom and independence. And it really is just me st uh, setting the stepping stones and kind of laying the foundation for a good, uh, stable retirement in the future. I also want to say we are at 78 subscribers. Thank you so much for the support. Truly, I've always wanted to start a YouTube channel. It's always been a dream of mine, and you guys are helping this dream come true. If you're new to the channel, my name is Ethan Chase, and I post videos every single day, usually, of me trading the stock market right behind here, and uh, multiple videos a week on personal finance, investing, side hustles. Uh, anything with money and wealth or life, that's kind of what I, I create. So if that interests you, hit the subscribe button. 93% of my viewers aren't subscribed, so if that's you, hit that subscribe button, join the family, and it would mean a lot to me. All right, I'm going to pull up my phone here, as you can see, phone, and I'm going to pull up the uh, Roth account to show you how much I have in it. Let's see if it wants to show it. <laughs> All right, whatever, the, the phone's not focusing, but um, we could go on screen and record real quick. All right, <laughs> awesome. As you can see, so here it is. As you can see, um, I have around $555 for trading. My initial deposit was $624 and like 15 cents or something like that. And I bought two shares of two different companies. Um, I'm not too, stop that. I'm not too kind of confident in the stock market right now. Um, I do have positions long and short just for kind of transparency, but um, I just don't know how what's gonna go on. Um, so I'm not, I don't want to put all my money in right now just to have the stock market come down. What I would rather do is invest a little bit of it. So right now I have around 10% invested. And then, so if the stock market doesn't go down and just keeps going up, well, I have 10% of upside and I miss 90%. But what I think is more likely is that the stock market could come down and recorrect itself. And if that happens, then I'll just dollar cost average and lower my cost basis if that happens. So that's kind of my strategy right now for my long-term investing. But um, I got $600 from my job, which I'm working right now at home. I'm working for a real estate company and I got my first paycheck, which is super exciting. And I put all the money straight into the Roth IRA account because I should be able to max it out this year with the money I'm getting from that job. And I'm living with my parents right now, so like living expenses and all, and all of that is pretty much taken care of besides food. From an expense perspective, I don't really need to have that much money like going out in expenses for my work. I'd rather just put all the money into the savings account right now. And I have, sa I have like savings elsewhere that I use for like daily purchases. Pretty exciting. Um, I put all of it, I put my first paycheck, all of it straight into the Roth IRA account. The goal is to max it out, uh, which is $6,000 the max right now. And I want to max it out. And hopefully if the stock market falls down and I can buy a bunch of very high quality dividend paying stocks at a cheap discount, that would be awesome because then I'm at a huge advantage in terms of positioning in the market and positioning in my retirement account. A complete side note, I was cleaning my room because I'm like, I like the minimalist vibes, but it was so messy. But what I found were these coins just sitting in my room. Now you might be thinking, who wants to focus? Oh, boom, there it is. There you go, so and then we have the other one, but you might be wondering, coins, that's not worth anything, but yeah, they are because, so I have two stacks. One are Euro coins from uh, like Euros. So I was in Spain, so coins from like Euros. And then these are from, um, from like US dollars, but here. So for the euros, we have two two dollar coins or two two dollar euros. So that's four euros. I don't know what the exchange rate is, but I'm assuming that's you know I'm pretty sure the like a dollar a euro is more expensive, so it's worth more than a dollar. So you get more dollars. So there's two of these suckers. So that's four euros plus I have a fifty cent euro coin. So that's four fifty in euros. Let me do the quick, quick translation here. 
you are to USD. Um, so if I cash in, I'm going to either factor in like a transaction fee, like convenience fee. So let's see, I have four dollars fifty cents worth of euros. That's about five dollars US. So let's do five dollars and sixteen cents US. Let's just do a thirty percent transaction fee, which is pretty high. So that's around three dollars six cents just sitting there, and that's. $3 straight going to Robinhood. If you want to start investing, I have a link to my Robinhood like referral in the description. And if you use it, you deposit money, you'll get a free stock, I'll get a free stock. And what you can do is you can start investing with as little as $5, maybe even a dollar, and buy fractional shares. I made a whole video about that. I'll leave that in the description as well. US dollar coins, I got, I don't know if they're real or not. I don't even know if the US dollar is still like a thing or if these are, I don't even know. I got, I'm gonna take them probably to a pawn shop or some sort of coin thing to find out, but I got one, two, three, four, five. So that's $5 right here. And I have two quarters, 50 cents. So I have $5.50 right here, plus probably like four bucks from the euro. So that's about $9 sitting in my room in coins, earning no interest, losing value because of inflation. I'm going to, uh, convert these suckers, hold up. I'm going to convert these suckers into dollars and put that straight into Robin Hood. So that's good. Um, but yeah, this is a little bit of a different Saturday story time, but it's kind of a milestone for me and I wanted to share this and I think it's a good kind of story time. It's more of a relaxed environment, me just talking. So that's, that's dope. <laughs> I think that's it for the video. I just want to say again, truly, thank you so much for all the subscriptions and the support. It truly means a lot, but thank you so much. With that said, I will see you in a light year.